I need some. Oh, it's like a certain twist will make it. Good morning, Campbell family. We uh we got a little bit of a problem. Hi, mommy. Hi. Why are you walking like that? Well, I injured myself at hockey last night. Went to the boards and my knee twisted. So I cannot walk properly. And poor Sky's still not feeling well? She's not feeling well. All of a sudden yesterday, she just, when we were out, having fun, she just wasn't feeling well, and so she's still warm. So, yeah. Oh, boy. <sighs> oh, it's like a certain twist will make it. <sighs> so you guys remember yesterday? And, you know, we sat right here on this couch and we're talking about how we're overwhelmed because, you know, we, we've got a lot to do in the next few weeks before we leave to the other side of the world. I don't, I don't think she needed this. I don't think we needed that. I mean, life happens and obviously, <laughs> but, uh. When it, what is it, the saying, when it rains, it's, when it rains, it pours. When it rains, it pours. And it's, it's actually pouring outside. It's like really, really raining really, really hard outside right now. And my poor daughter's not feeling well. Boy, not, you guys want to see family life? This is family life. Oh, boy. And, and on top of that, you're supposed to go to a wedding tonight. No heels for me. No way. I don't even, like... I don't even think you can go. You can't even walk. It looks, does it look swollen? No, it doesn't look swollen. <sighs> oh boy, oh boy. But how's your guys' morning going? Hope everyone's having a beautiful day, a positive day, a blessed Hi. day. <laughs> Sky. Hi, my hair is so messy. <laughs> He just woke up. My hair too. Look. Look at mommy's hair. So messy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guys. This really sucks. Um, yeah, I feel useless now. Um, because I have to sit down and elevate my leg. <laughs> Although this might be kind of nice. I'm getting a little break. Daddy is doing breakfast for Sky. <laughs> Look at his face, guys. But there is a little good news this morning. My eye, if you guys have noticed in the vlogs the last few days, my eye was like half shut. I think I mentioned that I had like a sty. It's starting to open up again. It's kind of, kind of even. Because for a while there, I was kind of like this. <laughs> but it's opening up again. It's good news. <laughs> not coffee FOI and fun fact about Eric and I we don't drink coffee or tea this is just I drink a little tea you drink tea sometimes I guess she drinks like tea sometimes but chai tea right no I drink green now because of the fasting green tea like I don't even know my own life but we don't drink coffee this is just water for me with a little bit of salt in it just to like try to hydrate for the day all right let's see what you guys are saying about our last vlog. Sandram Herman, 619. Pack light, you get most of the things in Asia anyway, and it's much cheaper too. Is it much cheaper though? I feel like, 
I, I think in like Thailand, from what I see, like I hear, like it's cheaper there. But like in the Philippines, things are fairly expensive still. No, like I know, like our money converted to pesos over there, like we get more pesos. But everything like kind of costs the same. Like a, a bottle of water is a dollar here. It's still a dollar there. From from what I'm seeing, and when I'm booking hotels, like everything still seems like it's a lot so are things like really cheaper there one oh eight two oh this is 20 minute vlog she wants 20 minutes 20 minutes okay. Pressure's on. it's a lot of camera cloud you show you a 20 minutes of vlog lydia cooper just make sure you have the past just make sure the passwords do not have less than six months on there oh, that's I a should, good tip I should check mine yeah, that's a good tip. Thank you. We should we should definitely check that. XCC zero one zero. Remember to get travel insurance. Very good. We we remembered that, and I looked into it, but I have not purchased it yet. So still, I'm, I thought you took care of that. I didn't actually purchase it, but I looked into it, and I know what I gotta do. I just called a physiotherapist office and unfortunately there is no openings today. She took my name and number down, so hopefully I'll get a call if they get a cancellation, but I'm not going to hold my breath because, yeah, it's hard what? to get a same day appointment, right? Same thing in the dental office. You saying hi, Sky? So I've been sitting here on this couch for a few hours now. It's almost 10 a.m. and I am not used to this much sitting on the couch for this long and I don't know what to do with myself. I don't want to get up. I am too scared to be honest to be walking on this knee. I'm, I'm too scared to get up and move. My knee it like really hurts. Um, I'm just afraid to move it because when I twist it a certain way, it hurts. And of course, you know, you're looking stuff up and I'm like, do I have a torn meniscus? Like, what is the process? What could potentially happen? Um, and right now I'm just feeling very useless and... I'm starting to get a little frustrated. Like, why, why did this have to happen? The most of the game, I was fine, and then the third period, like halfway through, I had to have this collision. And now I'm paying for it, like the aftermath. It's restricting me from doing anything because I can't walk. It hurts so badly. And I don't think I can do this for like, you know, it says to rest for two whole weeks. Like, how am I going to go to work? The kids are on March break. How am I going to do things with them? How am I going to do anything in the house? How am I even going to do anything for myself? Um, I'm thirsty right now and I need some water and like the kitchen just seems so far away. But I mean, I could, of course I can ask cash to get me some water. Um, but I need to do other things, right? I had to get up because I had to use the washroom with my trusty cane. <laughs> but I also found this. Oh my gosh, what a game changer. Um, it's, I'm not perfectly walking, but it helps so much. Um, I didn't realize that a knee brace would make a big difference. So hopefully this will tie me off for the rest of the day so we can still go to this wedding because I would hate to miss it. You know, after all, we did RSVP, but obviously you don't know that you're going to get injured the day before, so that's not expected, but I don't want to miss it. It's a family wedding and we haven't been to a wedding in a long time and I was really looking forward to spending some time alone with Troy tonight, so kind of like, you know, having a date night. And plus, I have a nice little cute dress that I want to wear. 
So yeah, I, I don't want to miss tonight. Looks like someone's home. Are you still coming to the wedding? I'm still going. You still coming? You're gonna go by yourself? Well, I'm trying to figure that out. Are you? Or are you gonna bring someone else? Was he thinking of bringing someone else? You still coming? Yeah. Look, I can still plug you. The kids are at grandma's now, and I'm getting ready. I'm trying to do my hair. I curl it with this flat on her, and I do not know how to use this thing. I, I YouTubed on how to curl your hair with flat iron, and I think this is how you do it. But then it turns out like this. Look, um, you can see this side. I did this side, but then like it's so flat up here. But then I got all these curls down here. I brushed it out a little bit and then I don't know how those hairdressers, like, they brush it out and then it just looks so nice and full here, but here, it, it's just so flat. <laughs> what is that? Oh my god. One thing about me, guys, is I am not a girly girl when it comes to doing hair and makeup it is very simple with me i do not use any of those um brushes or like eye makeup the like eyeshadow i mean the only eye makeup i will do is mascara and eyeliner and that's it i do not know how to do any of those blending or the contouring I've watched, you know, videos and tutorials um, on how to do it, but I just, I, I never got into it. <laughs> okay, give up, guys, I give up. Look, it's not working out. It's not very often that we get to go out, Troy and I, and, and, and actually go to a wedding is also. So I'm, I'm excited to go and have like a date night with Troy, but Chris Lee is just getting in the way. This pain in my knee is getting in the way. Because I won't be able to dance later. But regardless, I'm still gonna go. I'm gonna. No. I'm gonna soldier it out and try and make the most out of it. And just have a good time regardless. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm also very frustrated at this hair business. Oh, that one was nice. What is that one? See, that's a perfect one. Why can't I do it for the whole head? How did I do that one? I should, I should replay this and see how I did that. Okay, Campbell family. How do we do? How do we do? How do we do? How do we do? Oh la la. How did we do? Look at mama. Look at mama. Ta -da. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, you're missing something. Hold on. What am I missing? You're missing something. Hold on. You need this too. You need that too. There you go. Now you're now you're really looking good. I'm looking fun. <laughs> I think we cleaned up alright. I think we did okay. You know, I got the, the barong on because I'm getting ready for the Philippines. So I got the barong. We're going to a, a Filipino wedding. Yeah. And then I went for the uh, Filipino sleeves, like, you know. Oh, so. yeah. Okay, that is that's pretty right. Filipino. Because the girl I see your aunt's wearing that, yeah. I know. <laughs> Hopefully no one has the same dress as me. Mm. But, yeah, the couple that's getting married is Troy's cousin, and then he's marrying a Filipino girl, so. That's it. We're taking over. We're going to have some lumpia and some panza. <gasps> <laughs> I'm feeling the barong. Hey, and this is like the oh, yeah. first time. This is my second time wearing this. I wore this once at my wedding, 
our wedding <laughs> and today. So that's it. How Had to get some use out of that? it. Yeah, I you know, know, right? Like, when are you going to wear it again? That's it. But we're running late, so we got to get going. So we made it. We're seven minutes late, which I think is understandably okay since somebody is moving a little slow. We made it. We're here. Hopefully, I won't need the cane. <laughs> I left it in the truck, so. Sucks. Man. And this is us taking half an hour to get down the stairs. <laughs> so the good news is, this is a black and Filipino wedding, uh -huh. so it's not on time, so we are not late, <laughs> we did not miss a thing. Nope, even with me walking so slow. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, but listen, we want to enjoy the night. It's my cousin's wedding. It's a beautiful night. I'm here with my beautiful wife. So we're gonna end the vlog. So oh we my post. gosh, look at that chandelier, sorry. <laughs> okay, we have to show you the chandelier, hold on. Wow. Erica likes the chandelier. So hopefully you guys can hear us, but anyway, regardless, we hope wherever you are, you are safe. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hanging out with us. Pray for Erica's Pray for her knee. Hopefully it gets better. See, look, you're so tall. You're cutting me off. I know. Too. It's such a pain. We will find out. Pray for us. Pray for her. And we'll let, update you guys next vlog tomorrow. Whenever we vlog, we're trying to vlog as much as possible. Thank you for watching. Sending love from our family. To yours. I cut you off again. Yeah, you did. <laughs> One more clip, Campbell Cloud. <laughs> Erica's trying to dance on her broken knee. It's a slow dance, it's fine. Slow dance. <laughs>